Hello, my name is Gary Flooring and I'm with We Speak Medicare. In the next minute or two, I'd like to take you through one of our most frequently asked questions, which is, what are the major parts of Medicare and how do they affect me? Parts A and B are referred to as original Medicare provided by the federal government. Parts C and D are provided by private companies. Part A covers your hospitalization, skilled nursing services, and hospice care. Part B covers 80% of the costs of routine doctor visits and other outpatient medical services. If Medicare pays 80% of my Part A and Part B costs, how am I able to afford the other 20% plus the cost of my prescriptions? One option is to bundle together Parts A and B into a Medicare Advantage plan, which is also known as Part C. As far as prescription drugs are concerned, there's a Medicare Part D. It covers some or most of the cost of your drug prescriptions, depending on the plan. Medicare supplements. These are also referred to as Medigap plans. Once Medicare Parts A and B have paid 80%, Medigap plans kick in to cover the other 20%. However, they do not cover Part D prescription drugs. It can be pretty confusing, especially when you consider all the parts to Medicare. Parts A and B are original Medicare provided by the federal government. Parts D, C, and Medigap plans are private company managed insurance plans that can be combined with Parts A and B. A Part C cannot be combined with a Medigap plan. You can see the resources here at medicare.gov or ssa.gov. If you have further questions about Medicare parts and coverages and enrollments and eligibility, give me a call.